Good morning and welcome to JSA TV, where we are covering the latest stories, trends, and innovations from leaders across the digital infrastructure industry. Today, I am happy to be coming to you live from the expo floor of Yada 2024 in beautiful Las Vegas, and we'll be bringing you updates throughout the day, so be sure to stay tuned. And we are kicking things off with some extra special guests. Extra special love for our very first guests of the very first Yada, I might say. We've got Light Source Communications here. Joining me now, we have Deborah Freitas and Pete MP. Thank you so much for stopping by and starting your day with us. Well, thank you so much. We um, are thrilled to be back on JSA TV, so we appreciate you having us. Always enjoy having you guys here. So you have had a little bit going on lately. You just got done with a very big rebrand effort. Congratulations. Thank you. And and tell us about that. What was behind that and, and what's going on there? Well, we're really excited about it for sure. Um, Light Source has been around for 10 years, so this is our 10 year anniversary. and. Um, it, we felt like it was a really good time to come out with a new logo, new website, and just a, a general rebranding. We've ex, um, expanded internally and externally. We've hired some new top executives for our team, and we have a lot of exciting projects that we're working on. Um, so it just kind of all made sense for right now. Yeah. Okay. Sounds like we need to stay tuned. Probably a lot more to come there. A lot. Yeah. What are some of those key initiatives, if you can tell us just a little bit? Sure. On our Brie brand, we have a beautiful new logo. Um, I just, I'm so thrilled about it. It um, really speaks to the um, trajectory that LightSource has. Yeah. So that's really, really exciting for us. And that is out. It's on our LinkedIn and things like that. Um, and then we have a new website, too, which um, is it's beautiful. It's not launched just yet. It'll be coming really soon. But um, we're really excited for that to be coming out as well. Yeah. And and we should just give folks who maybe aren't extremely familiar with what you've been doing, um, can you just explain for us just kind of how you operate in the space and, and how, how you sure. help your clients? Yeah. So we are a dark fiber provider. And um, 10 years ago when we first started, we were uh, concentrating on the long haul fiber network with would connect the metro areas to each other. And now the market has really driven us to metro dark fiber. And as we announced um, just recently into a new market, we will talk about it in, in a minute. And um, the last time we were on JSA TV, we announced the Phoenix market, which has grown. It has doubled in size in the last three months. And that's kind of indicative of what is happening with the dark fiber market itself. Yeah, you're absolutely right. There are definitely those hot spots where that's the story across the country. So that definitely will be a need. Okay, you, you hinted at what's to come. Is there anything else that you can give us? And I'll well, leave that very open-ended for you. Yeah, thank you. Um, well, last week we announced Tulsa. And we have previously had long haul routes in Tulsa of about 50 miles. But we announced two metro rings, very excited to be building out Tulsa significantly, adding almost another additional 100 miles to the Tulsa region. Wow. That's another hotspot up and coming market right in the it middle is. of America. It is. Absolutely. So talk to me a little bit about AI, artificial intelligence. We're going to be hearing a lot about AI here at the conference. For and sure. of course, it's, it's everywhere, everywhere you look right now, people are talking about AI. How has that been a factor for you and for your team? Sure. It's, it, well, it's really the driving factor for us. And as we evolved over the last 10 years, we started out really um, helping the hyperscalers get from point A to point B. Now, the hyperscalers model has changed significantly because of artificial intelligence and the need for the sheer number of fibers to be able to carry artificial intelligence is driving their market, which then drives our market. Uh, really, everything that we're doing and the push you see to all the build out is to support artificial intelligence. Yeah. Yeah. It's not going away, is it? No, it's no. not. It's it's no. exploding. So we're really excited to be a part of it. And um, we're looking forward to what we can do, you know, to help those companies grow. Absolutely. Well. Anything else that you guys want to uh, make sure that our viewers know about, about what you're working on and what's to come? Well, we, um, you know, other than, like Pete mentioned, we have the Phoenix route that is really um, exploding. We're super excited about that. So, um, you know, that, that market, the whole ecosystem there is um, exciting for us and for, you know, our customers as well. So that's great. 
and Tulsa and, um, you know, hopefully some additional things in the future. Yes, a lot more to come. So we'll hope to have you back again on JSA TV soon so you Would can let to. us know all about uh, how the rebrand is going. We are really looking forward to seeing the new website and uh, just looking forward to keeping in touch with you guys. Thanks so much. Thank you very much for stopping by. And to our viewers, thank you so much for tuning in. Make sure you stick around. A lot more to come here from the showroom floor at Yada. In the meantime, stay curious and stay connected.